But yeah, in this I want to discuss uh, MTC um, sensors from uh, washing machines. I've got a, a number here to uh, show, and there's a, also another one in a, a bowl that I'm going to test later. Um, what I want to say is that um, they have different capacities. Uh, this one is uh, marked on the side. You can't really see because it's too um, too faint. Uh, that's 4.8 kilo ohms. So that's one. Uh, this one is also marked on the side. That's 20 kilo ohms. And uh, this one also is 20 kilo ohms. Now I've noticed um, that the 20 kilo ohm ones come in in this size, which is the large heater element, and um, 4.8 came into this size, the uh, shorter heating element, so that, that might be a clue as to um, what capacity yours might be, uh, but you need to check anyway. Um, if you can't read on the side what the rating is, then um, you can use a, a multimeter uh, set to ohms to uh, show you what they are. Um, some, something else I want to say is that um, uh, they're quite difficult to remove from the device. You have to um, uh, prise it with a, a screwdriver to, to actually remove it. It's usually a tight fit. I may recommend put some um, washing up liquid on it when you put them back in. So uh, that's uh, my suggestion um, for you, that you must check the rating of the NTC sensor in order to make sure your washing machine will